In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Canon scanner. And this is the Canon Scan LID 400 scanner. I'm going to set up with my MacBook. Now, first thing is to download the drivers in the MacBook. So go to the MacBook screen, open the web browser, and type in ij.start.canon and select Canon Official Manuals Welcome. That is the Canon website. Click Setup Start here. Type in 400 and look for LID E400. Go. Select MOS on the top. There is the Mac operating system. Automatically it will do that. Click Download. Open the file. Double click. Double click on setup. Open. So that's our installation window. Select start setup. Next. Select your country of residence. Yes and click agree on the terms and conditions. Now connect your scanner with the MacBook. So one end of the scanner, connect the USB cable like this. So this is a USB-C and the other end goes to MacBook. Once you connect it, automatically it will detect and click on the next button. You can create a shortcut for online manual or you can just click do not. Click exit and close all the windows. Now we have to add this scanner in our MacBook so that we can start using it. So go to the system preferences, select printers and scanners. On this window you will see there is a plus button that is on the left hand side corner click on it select canon lid 400 and click on the add button you should be able to see the canon lid 400 open scanner so let's do a quick scan so that we can see if it's working or not now open the top scanner lid now place anything you want to scan. For example, I'm going to scan an artwork. So I'm going to face it downwards like this. Close the lid. Now go to the scanner and click on the open scanner. Now we have to select the size we want to keep of this artwork and also select the DPI. The maximum DPI is 4800 pixels. So let's do that and see how big it is and how long it takes for that. We can save it to the desktop and we'll give a name to it Artwork 3 format we just want a jpeg so we'll see how big the file it comes up and click on the scan icon so we can see it's scanning and because we are scanning at a maximum dpi resolution so it might take few minutes and we will definitely wait and we'll see what's the result for that so scan is complete and it took around 10 minutes for that and the reason was the high resolution so let's open the artwork so that's the artwork and if we check so that's our original and that's the scanned copy so 
I did the resolution at very high end. So this way we can do the complete setup and we can start using it for scanning. If you want you can scan documents and you can also scan multiple documents and save it as a PDF. Thanks for watching.